What's up guys, Jimmy with the Outdoor Affiliate. Today we're going to cover how to hand tie a bass jig. What you'll need is a fly tying vise, super glue, silicone skirt tabs, bobbin with thread, blank jig, and some scissors. Start off, get your jig secured in your vise, and take your bobbin with your thread, bring it around one side, leave a tag line, uh, just enough for you to grab onto about an inch above the jig, and you work your way around in the same direction, covering the whole base of where you have your tying surface at. Once you have your whole area that you could tie covered, put your tab over, then wrap the tag line all the way to the other side. Make sure that's nice and secure. Cut your tag line. You don't have to, but I like to put a little dab of super glue on the tag. Need glue. Having some technical difficulties. Just gonna wipe some of that glue off. Once you let the glue dry for a second, you start off with your lighter color tabs on the bottom. Uh, all fish species are darker colored on the top, so just to match the hatch. You want a lighter color on the bottom and darker colors towards the top. So just get your tag centered, or get the center of your tab centered. Put about two wraps on it. That'll just hold it in place and then you can get the tab where you want it. Put a few wraps on it. You take your top tab, split it in half, and you get that held in there like this. Get a about two wraps on it. Then the same thing as the top tag. You'll be able to put it where you want and just pull it tight. I like to wrap it like around 10 times after I get both tabs secured. Once you're satisfied with the wrap, get a little line out of the bobbin, hold it, and then wrap it around. Then you're going to put the bobbin through your loop. Pull it tight. Make another loop. This time you're gonna put your bobbin through the lot through the loop twice. 
cool that tight. I always do one more single loop. Make sure that's nice and tight. You can cut your excess. I use some of this glue I had earlier just to make sure that the thread does not allow any of the skirt tabs to move. Let that dry for a second. Then you just pull your skirt tabs, and just cut them towards the end. Nice and easy way to tie and uh, holds the tabs in place pretty well. Then if you want to trim them up on the bottom, I managed to get them pretty even, but you can trim them up with scissors if you want them a little more even. If you want a natural look where they're not so even, you can just leave them any length, but that's it. Simple way. Holds skirts tight. I never had any problems with the movement, especially with the glue and uh they hold up well. See, man, it's not to lose them. All right, have a good one.